People ask us all the time where we are from. Our response is Cordell, Georgia. Many people may not know where Cordell is located. However, if you ask them if they know where the rocket is located on Interstate 75, they respond, oh yeah. The Titan missile is located at the intersection of I-75 and Highway 280. The Rotary Club began this project. It was a dream of its president, John Pate Jr. His dream became a reality on July 17th. 1969. Mr. Pitt was gracious enough to come and talk with us about his experience. Thank you for asking me to talk to you about the missile at I-75 and Cordial 280 at Cordial. And, uh, I was president of Rotary Club back in 1968 and the purpose of the club is to help the community, to support the community and do things that we think would, would help, uh, help the community out. And so. I was on a trip to Cape Kennedy and I saw one of the launches down there and I thought, wow, that would be nice to have a display like they have here in Port Eel so it would make us stand out. Because if a community does not have something special about it for people to remember, they'll just pass on by. And so I thought it would really be good for the community and I talked to the club about it, all the members. and. And they agreed, we, and so we raised the money to, to bring it. In 1990, a team of technicians from Robbins Air Force Base discovered the missile was radioactive after a local tourism committee sought to give it a facelift. Four years later, a team from Arizona came and discovered that the missile contained non-life-threatening radioactive material. It was removed anyway. Mr. Pay and the other members wanted to make our community stand out. They came up with the slogan, Meet Me at the Missile. Meet us at the Missile! On July 17, 2008, Cordial celebrated the missile's 40th anniversary by rechristening the Titan Missile. Every person, place, and thing has a story. The Titan Missile story began in 1968 and continues today in 2012.